Our collaboration with the City of Boston has been absolutely instrumental in advancing our thinking on how autonomous vehicles will actually impact mobility within the world cities. It's been a great collaboration with the City of Boston. It's been a great collaboration with BCG. The collaboration with the World Economic Forum has been an amazing opportunity for the City of Boston. We have come a long way in the last 12 months. It wouldn't have been possible without their support. This collaboration has helped us accelerate autonomous vehicle testing and take enormous strides. Last January, we celebrated the first autonomous mile driven in our city. It's amazing to think that a year ago, uh, we were here and we had no autonomous vehicles on our streets. We had no testing policy for autonomous vehicles. We didn't have uh, the sort of relationships we have with stakeholders across the globe that we have today. We're thrilled with the progress we've made in the past year. We went from talking about autonomous vehicles to a full-blown testing program, over a thousand miles traveled. We established a partnership with Lyft, which is ongoing, and that's been a very fruitful collaboration, not only by allowing us to pilot our vehicles on the Lyft network, but also to work hand-in-hand -hand with Lyft to understand that rider experience. I would say exciting, awesome, beautiful, wonderful, all the positive words I can think of. And what we were able to do is test under daylight conditions, under uh, complicated intersections, how to keep vehicles within their lane, how to be able to pass, how to be able to interact with pedestrians and all kinds of moving objects in the environment. We're delighted to collaborate on uh, creating a mobility platform and here in the city of Boston with the World Economic Forum, the Boston Consulting Group, because in many ways it's the best way we can make sure that everybody's trip in the city uh, works for each person and works for all people. We're exploring a variety of options so that we don't just take folks from public transit systems and put them in single occupancy automated vehicles. We want to explore different policy options that really provide a landscape where AVs can complement our public transit system. For us, it's never been about the city of Boston per se. It's been about urban mobility. It's been about how do we provide mobility to citizens of cities around the world in a manner that's safe, clean, and inclusive. Over the last two years, I visited 100 cities city mayors, city administration, transport authorities. And the example of what we did in Boston has been a big reference case for many of them. They want to learn how it is possible to shape the mobility of the future in a sustainable yet impactful way.